we are basically saying that we want to create the world's best bank uh, for uh, consumers and entrepreneurs in this country right here in India is our mission statement we are going after. Hi friends, good morning all. Hope you are having this happy weekend right now. So, I just gone through this many days of researching only one bank called uh, IDFC First Bank. Now you could ask me, ask me the question from where IDFC First Bank really came. So, there was an IDFC company called Capital First which was created by B. Vaitenagan and it was actually a takeover company and there was elsewhere IDFC Bank. So this NBFC as well as this IDFC Khan and combined into a group entity called IDFC First Bank Limited and that is what we are going to see. As far as Capital First is concerned, I must say that in 8 years, this company started with a 94 crore rupee loan book in 2010. In 2 years from 2010 to 2012, the company developed some very unique models of financing small entrepreneurs who were not being financed by the existing banking system and who do not file the income tax returns. And by financing those customers and consumers, the bank, the company then grew and in seven years the company grew to a scale of uh, 30,000 crores. So it had a CAGR of 29% of growth, a profit trajectory of 55% CAGR for five years and a profit of 320 crores as of 2018. Now therefore when you put the pieces together, you get a strong platform of IDFC Bank, you get the profitability and the retail machine of, IC, of uh, of uh, capital first and together we get IDFC First Bank. So in this video, I would be speaking as well as I would like to attach the sound bites of the latest IDFC First Bank AGM, I think which was conducted in 2019. Why it is so? Because whenever we, we recommend a share for a long term, we always say the management said like this, the management said like that. So we are trying to prove that uh, media bits for you so that you could also see what is the real man behind IDFC First Bank is trying to prove to the world. And this is about IDFC First Bank share latest news. So friends, if you consider this bank to be, I think, I think from the period of one to two years right now, where the management has said they are going to build the world best bank as I can see. Why I am so much confident because this person behind it, B. Vaidyanathan, has really nurtured the growth rate of ICCA Bank because he was the person behind uh, this uh, ICCA Bank retail book development. So that is also attached to this media bed clip. You can also go and check there. But friends, put together, I believe within a period of around two to three years, a best bank that you could choose, I think it would it would be IDFC First Bank Limited. Definitely, I think friends, if you consider July 28th is a result for this quarter of this company. So if you wish to acquire on the Monday, okay, or if you wish to acquire after the result, it is also okay. But I just want to show you the sound bites. The sound bites will follow now and between which I would be speaking about several factors point that I want to keep you updated about IDFC First Bank Limited. Thank you friends and let us now move to the sound bites. So I assure you that I have seen this face at least twice in my life when at ICICI Bank for the first one or two years retail business was starting up, it was investment but after that by 2003, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 till today in 2018 or 2019, it is, uh, it is a perennial growth story. Today I am told that ICICI Bank retail business has crossed about uh, 3 lakh crores and when we started it was 200 crores. Similarly, in Capital First, when that business started for two years, 2010, 2011, 2012, it was loss making. Our company was loss making in 2010, 11, 12. There was some profit we booked, that is because we booked some, uh, you know, securitization gain upfront and all that. But on the core, but in 2013, when we posted our first profit of 55 crore, I remind you, we started in 2010, 2011 loss, 2012 loss, 2013 loss. But because it was investment, no shortcut, no upfront booking, nothing. But after that, in 13, profit became 
And if you put 800 branches, you can imagine how much investment we are making. So for one or two years, you have to, you will see that investment will come, operating expense will come. I am requesting you to mentally take note of the fact that the bank will be investing and incurring a lot of expenditure on this front. So when we see the profit and loss account for one or two years, this will be uh, uh, probably, it will become profitable, but not extraordinarily profitable. But after two years or so, you will see the profit uh, uh, rising. I can also... Why I chose particularly this bank, you could ask me, friends, okay? And the main reason why I chosen this bank is that I understand the company's urge or this bank urge to develop the retail book. And why it is so? Because in retail book only, people could easily gain so much of profit, their margin could improve, their profitability could improve to a great extent. And as you have seen this previous video, I said that it would take at least two years for them to develop this kind of things. I mean, that's creating other branches and uh, making many uh, investors to pump in. As well as, I mean, our nest pipe will follow by a CASA ratio deposit because as a bank, Current, current account is to savings account ratio is very, very important and I think they are developing really the right? and as you know friends the retail asset book is really very, very important so when one is two I mean 2019 they have spoken let us take for this COVID-19 another one year so up, almost up to 2023 starting let us take a simple calculation so in the year of 2023 we could see a beautiful beautiful nurture price in the IDFC first bank limited. It could take time. Yes, but friends, I always say this patient pays reward. Investing in a good share is very important. You know how many years that IDFC first bank take in order to sustain in this level. In order to having a great market capital. So I believe IDFC first bank could have the success between that the result could go down, go up, each and everything. But holding on tightly could definitely give you a massive massive amount of wealth in IDFC first bank. Now I think it, this video clip next week is going to be that regarding the CASA ratio deposit things. I think that is very important for our friends to see it. So happy to tell you that our CASA strategy is already working. Just to share with you, our CASA as of December was 6400 crores. As we speak, CASA has touched 10,000 crores. In fact, CASA, we are getting year-on-year -year growth of 64%. 64%. Many people think that CASA generation is most difficult. I told you Morgan Stanley, Deutsche Bank, CNBC, Lata Venkatesh, everyone is after us saying that it's very difficult. But they will all be proved wrong, I'm assuring you. And I can tell you that uh, this, this uh, CASA is, uh, we have guided that we will touch 30% in five years. I can assure you, I I am quite confident that we will uh, reach there ahead of time. Main particular points that my friends wants to see. If you want to see the full video, you could go to the YouTube and search this IDC First Bank AGM. The full video will be there. And I urge each and everyone who has seen this video to see that AGM video fully so that you could get some beneficial stock points also. So friends, now let us come to a point can i buy idc first bank and wh what are the reasons i am urging my friends you could have at least and i am not forcing you to buy rather i am not forcing you to sell i just want make sure people know there is a bank called idfc first bank and that bank is and the bank is trying to be the world best bank with no corporate governance issue and with no shortcuts and with no uh, what to say any trickiness they want to maintain their balance sheet correctly they want to maintain their provisions currently they don't want to sue one of the funds like we have seen in many banks you know i just don't, don't want to many comments regarding that and, and, and as you can see the the, the person we basically think really said the Morgan Stanley, this person will be proved wrong. I think this type of having the fire in their belly, I think that is the main, main thing that I would watch because when the management is strong and the company's probability is strong, that's going to be very good. Now, friends, you think like this, okay? Uh, we were in a $5 trillion economy. What happens in this company when this India goes to five, $50 trillion uh, economy? I think there will be more, more transactions, more, more opportunities in the banks. I think if IDFC, I mean, if you hold IDFC, IDFC first bank, the great management is with Vaidenya, then I think when the years pass by, you could see how your, your investment could nurture to a great extent. Now, also I'm saying the same thing again, friends. I'm not forcing you to buy, rather, I'm not forcing you to sell, but make sure you at least now go and see and you at least go and see the share thing 
know about it and that was only thing so if you consider friends idfc first bank idfc first bank in which idfc bank has has has, has the infrastructure loan i think in india infrastructure loans very very difficult to maintain and due to political tensions and various other tensions and that's why the management said we are focusing on retail book we are focusing on one direction they also said we are trying to bring down the whole uh, infra, infra book to nil making the period of us by coming by so put together there's a beautiful beautiful benefit for idfc first bank let us see if all things are placed correctly for idfc first bank i believe i i, I mean i don't want to give target of idfc first bank if you want to say uh, i already give a target of 30 rupees for a short term but that is that will not that will work or that will not work i'm not sure about it but many things friends holding for a long term i believe really i mean this kind of banks could have a future in the may have the future but what is that means you should have the patience to hold it whatever may be the situation come and go if you hold it you could be definitely got it just because see the march 19 I mean the march 2020 fall you could see the share gone up to 19 rupees now it is 28 rupees almost the price is going to be uh, almost price has raised in the 50 or uh, 55 percent and so if you put all the factors to place you will get that idc first bank is trying to prove to this uh, world that they are going to be the world best bank so with this video ending the last bite clip i'm going to attach and friends you just you know then make sure you please click the subscribe button as well as you please share this video as well as you please please go and check about adsc first bank limited i am urging you to definitely go and check about it read their annual report so that you could also get i guess your knowledge about idfc first bank the last and final clip of this idfc first bank video is now coming by for you story picks up it became a one-way track to profits I am quite confident here also once we go through this two-year phase then I am quite confident all of your shareholders will see that phase but you have to bear with me for two years because this is the phase when that investment has to be made for the foundation for the long-term interest of the organization if we do shortcuts the shortcut will work for two years but then we all know where that game ends